right, so to solve this absolute value equation, we have to think about this a little bit. So it's telling us that the absolute value of the fraction x minus 3 over 4 is equal to a positive 5. Now because of the absolute value signs that make anything positive, we don't know if it was originally negative or positive. So we have to account for both instances. So let's break this up into those two possibilities. We'll have x minus 3 over 4 is equal to positive 5 or x minus 3 over 4 is equal to negative 5 because we're not sure which one. So now we can solve this for x. Let's pay attention to the equation on the left first. We can multiply both sides by 4 so that we get x minus 3 is equal to 20. And then we can add 3 to both sides so that we have x equals 23. Looking at the other one now, we can do the same thing and multiply both sides by 4 again. And that'll give us x minus 3 equals negative 20. And then we can add the 3 to both sides. And we have x is equal to negative 17. So our answer is here. Our x equals 23 or x equals negative 17.